More mail. It's mail day. More collections coming through every single day. Uh, let's open them and see what we have. I think it's going to be a mix of sports cards, uh, Marvel cards, maybe Star Wars cards. These are the type of mail days that I, I just, I look forward to so much. We have so much to go through here. We're going to go pretty quick because there's a lot, but if you're a fan of pop culture, Game of Thrones, Marvel, Star Wars, sports cards, football, I have it all. I say this every time. Yes, we buy collections. You can go to ChasingTheHobby.com. You can fill out the form if you have a collection you want us to look at. You can message us on Instagram, on TikTok, anywhere you want. You can email us at ChasingTheHobby at gmail.com. So we're going to go through all of this, and uh, we'll start off with Todd. Huge shout out to Todd. We made a deal for his collection, which is what you see right here and right here. And it's just, I'm kind of nerding out because I love pop culture stuff, specifically when it comes to Game of Thrones and Marvel and stuff like that. So let's get going and we'll talk about it as we go. Like I said, we're going to go pretty fast. First stack, we've got Kara Danvers for Supergirl. We've got a... Uh, Night King, Winter's here, Game of Thrones, Lannister, Hear Me Roar, just some really cool stuff. And then we jump right in to a Masterworks Auto. Like I said, I'm going to go pretty fast. Ezra Bridger, I mean, uh, not a better time than right now. No spoilers for Ahsoka, but if you're not watching Ahsoka, you definitely should be. John Robinson, Lost in Space. We literally have a little bit of everything. Look at this, Supergirl, on-card autos. Full bleed, if you will. Uh, there's Daenerys. I mean, Game of Thrones. We may have an auto of her. Is that a printing plate from the OGs? Oh, wow. That is... What? That's so cool. We've got Star Trek. We've got Beyond. We've got more Game of Thrones. What is this? Charmed Forever. Relics. Look at that. All of these will end up in pop culture mystery boxes. So we launch in a couple weeks. We will not be launching the pop culture series right when the website launches. Unfortunately, it'll be a few weeks after. But how it's going to work is we'll have at least two different types of pop culture mystery boxes. Meaning, those are the ultimate chase. If you buy one of those, everything can be in there. Anything from political to history to celebrities to music to TV shows, to movie, you can pull Marvel, Star Wars, anything you see here. And then we're also going to have a dedicated Star Wars mystery box series as well. Because Star Wars is so big in the card industry and getting bigger and bigger, we kind of felt that we needed to have its own product. Now in the future, we'll have limited runs when we get enough inventory of, say, Game of Thrones. Or we'll have a limited run box of Marvel stuff. But Star Wars will always have its own dedicated box. Look at that. That's so cool. That's old school. All right, let's keep going. This is all Todd stuff right here. All right, what do we got here? Lost in Space. Lost in Space. NCIS. Why not, right? Shang-Chi. That's cool. Is that? Razor Fist. I think that's just commemorative. I don't think that's anything like actual relic memorabilia worn, but it's still cool. They're film cells. They're neat. That's neat. Look at that. Very, very cool. If you're opening and you hit something like it, look at this. Me and Ashley love Outlander. We are on season seven at the midpoint, waiting for the second half. Season eight is going to be the final one. You talk about an emotional roller coaster of a series. We are committed to this show all the way to the end. Look at that. That is awesome. Jamie, number 10 of 250. I kind of want to keep that one. Convention exclusive, another Outland. Outlander, Jamie, Fraser, 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 wardrobe. That is so cool. If you haven't watched Outlander, you need to. All right, we've got a little more. They're, they're falling over here because there's so much from Todd, but that's okay. Like I said, the pop culture series, the mystery boxes, it's the ultimate chase. You could pull a presidential cut autograph. You could pull a, 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 a Star Wars autograph. I mean, you could, you could pull something uh, from uh, Supergirl. You could pull, I know for a fact that we have a Jay-Z Topps Chrome rookie card. Anything celebrity, music, artist, anything that's deemed pop culture could be in those boxes. Look at this. Full bleed. I think that's considered full bleed, right? Where the bottom kind of, maybe not because there's a border. I never understood that, but we're going to, look at that, look at that. 
Dude, these guys like go all out with their autos. Game of Thrones all day. I want to go rewatch it. Would you be happy pulling stuff like this out of mystery boxes? Look at that one. Told you it was a lot. I probably need to get going quicker, don't I? Because we have so much to go through. We've got a Christopher Pike game. I say game used. I'm so on the sports. And what do they call them? What do we call them here? Authentic piece of costume material game used. Come on, Jimmy. What is that? Bonita from James Bond Goldfinger. Wow. Where would you even pull the upper deck? That's... Jeez. That is so cool. Okay. Shout out to Todd for that. Next up, I'm not even sure who this came from. I couldn't figure it out off the box, but shout out to you. I know I, I know I did a deal with somebody. The Defenders upper deck, we've got a printing plate. That's cool. Aaron Kellyman, Falcon and the Winter Soldier. WandaVision, WandaVision stuff is cool. That's neat from Spider-Man. Jimmy Woo. Another Jimmy Woo film sales, but these are autograph film sales. <laughs> Oh, that is, that's a cool one. That's a cool one. Uh, they just keep going. The hits just keep coming. We have a Paul Bettany at the end. All right, this last one is a big shout out to Ryan. We've purchased multiple collections from Ryan. I told you we would have some sports in here. So here we go. We've got a Drake London Select Rookie. Bryce McGowers Rated Rookie Optic Donruss. Mac Jones. What is this? A Drew Brees Downtown Jim Mint 10. Okay. All right. I'm telling you guys, he's going to make the ultimate comeback this year. Buy low. Buy low on jaw. Tom Brady, 2008 Tops Rookie, PSA 7. There's Herbie. You can't go wrong with a Herbie autograph. Somebody will pull that and be just ecstatic. Matthew Stafford, Black Pandora. Wow. 5 of 25. That's cool. And we've got another Brady 2012 Panini PSA 9. <laughs> what in the world? Oh my gosh. Sam Howell, Jahan Dotson. Look at how big the patches are. On card. Is that numbered? That's got to be numbered. 20 of 49. Wow. I don't even know if we're going to be able to fit that in a box. But it's going to go in a box. If we have to custom cut the foam insert... It's going. All right, guys, if you're still here with me, click the lead link at the bottom where it says sign up. That will get you on the email list at chasingthehobby.com. So you will be in the loop knowing when we actually launch, whenever new product launches, giveaways, all that stuff. So make sure you guys join it and uh, it's coming. It's coming really soon. If you have any questions, feel free to hit me up. I didn't even realize that Hendrix bought this. That's cool.